It's, uh, how's it going? It's your boy Jelly. I'm doing quite all right. Today I want to give you guys uh, an update on the house. You know, you remember that house that I moved into about a month ago? Well, we put furniture in it now and it looks pretty amazing. So let's get started. All right, so we're starting off in the hallway. All right, that's the door we entered the house from. It, it's an apartment, by the way. It's an apartment, not, not a house. This is where we hang up our jackets every day. That, that's an amazing plan. That's some luggage because I just got home from a trip to Portugal. Portugal was nice. Those are my really awesome skateboards. I don't really skateboard, but yeah, they're pretty awesome. And that's my dog. <laughs> Hello, dog, how's it going? Nala. Hello. <laughs> So yeah, uh, we're still in the moving procedure, so it, it's it's not exactly the cleanest house. As you can see, we've still got a, a lamp there that we gotta hang up. You, you see it? You, you see it? It's right there. And then there's some storage there. Nah, do you really have to make it a mess? Hey! And that's some laundry. Anyway, let's not, let's not, nope, let's not do that. No, los. Okay, good girl, good girl. We're gonna throw this ball away because it's making a mess in the house. Grab it up. And there you go. All right, so the first door is over there, which is the toilet. Let me let me show you. This is our, our toilet where we do our morning poopoos. We're human too, okay. So these are these are Santa's plants and candles and perfumes. Uh, this is this is just the toilet, right? It's not. It doesn't have a shower or anything. It's just the toilet with a temporary lamp. Okay, that's not gonna be the final lamp. It's just so we've got some light. We're going with the boring things first, okay? I hope that's fine. The second door that we see over here is, well, the main door, but that's not the second, is this door, which uh, <clears throat> is probably a really boring room as well. Probably, probably, I'm not sure. We've got tripods, we've got some gear, we've got laundry, and vacuum, and yeah, it's a storage room. A really big, messy storage room with our ventilation system and boiler. Really interesting, okay, we're getting out of here. <laughs> All right, so that's over there, and then we can go to either the left or the right. Which one do you wanna to go to first? Who the hell just closed that? That's really creepy. I guess we're going to the left first. All right, so that's that's the left side. This is pretty much like the main area of the house, starting off with the kitchen, all right? We've got some YouTube money over here, looking really fancy. We've got a pan here that, I can put this away, we didn't use this. That's our sink, this is our dishwasher, and then we've got some storage compartments and ventilation system. You know, it's just a normal kitchen. Our bin, some trash, some more trash, a microwave because, well, uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna add some more things into this kitchen. So this is, like, this is like the middle part of the kitchen. Now, we're adding another section here. It's gonna look exactly the same like this, but we're gonna add it over here with this extra fridge and we're gonna put a microwave and an oven in there as well. It's gonna be like a little bar area with some with some chairs here that you can just sit down. Oh, can I have a drink, please? All right, all right. And then you go have that drink and finish it. Don't don't drink, kids, don't do it. So yeah, this is our actual fridge where we have food looking delicious and that's my camera and me. <laughs> This is our freezer. Uh, yeah, European fridges are tiny, but whatever. This is our microwave slash oven. We don't really use this. Some more storage things. Anyway, that's the kitchen. This over here is Nala's toy section where she keeps all her toys. And then on this side, we have her food and water bowl. So yeah, that's really interesting. Now, on the right of this kitchen, we've got a pillar where there's like ventilation things going through because it's an apartment building. And then over here we've got technically, oh my God, now I made a really big mess over here. Technically we have a dining area, but we're not gonna use it as a dining area. This is gonna be like a lounge area, all right? This is a spare TV, by the way. There's gonna be like a nice painting here, a nice painting there. There's gonna be a nice mat here and a cool little lounge chair. This is gonna be like a relaxing corner because the main area is over there. Oh, and also it might feel really closed off here, but like there's a lot of windows, like a lot, a lot of windows, okay? <laughs> we decided to put a lounge area here instead of dining because it's nicer to eat 
over there because you can actually have a really nice view from there. You can actually sit down there and look at the view and at the sunset instead of over here, which is technically a little bit of a dark corner. So yeah, this is just gonna be a launch area with the bar on that side. I hope this is making sense, guys. So you might be wondering, well, Jelly, why, you, why do you have a spare TV here? Well, the folks over at LG hooked me up with a brand new TV. Oh my goodness, this thing is so sexy. So before the LG TV, I had that one. Now, we just mounted the new TV. It's an OLED 65 inch 4K wallpaper edition TV. What that means, it's that it's super thin. Let me just show you. Actually, before we get into that, let me show you the rest of the room. <laughs> Alright, so like I was saying, this is actually a dining room, but we moved it over here. Also, those are some spare chairs for outside. They don't belong there. We're still in the moving procedure, guys. Anyway, dining room, which uh, is not really finished yet. We've got a cool light, though, but there's going to be like a nice carpet here. We're going we're gonna to have some paintings here. Everything still needs curtains, by the way. We, we ordered curtains, but they're still on their way. It takes like three to four weeks. Uh, so yeah, this is where we eat, and then once we sit down, let me just show you, I'm gonna sit down. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, that's, that's comfortable. So I eat here, and then I can look at the beautiful view. Oh, magnifique. Actually, there's a little pole in the way, you see that? But we can look over it like that. Wow, really nice. Wow, radical, bro. This is my crocodile. I love this thing, it's amazing. Anyway, so this is where we eat, sometimes, or, in the lounge area, which is like the TV lounge area. So this is where we sit down. This is our massive couch where we sit down and watch movies and Netflix and chill and yeah, we've got a lot of pillows. I hope you noticed that. This is a really cozy corner because, well, it's really bright in here. There's a lot of windows. Also, you can walk outside anywhere. All these windows, you can open them, you can go outside. Um, but then if you walk by in here, this is actually like a, like a free window where there's nothing blocking the view and the TV is over here. And look at that beautiful thing. So me and my dad actually hung this thing up yesterday. Uh, it's one hell of a freaking TV. <laughs> these are some flowers, a little thing. These are, all, these are all temporary like tables for the couch because we haven't managed to get one yet. We also need some carpets here. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a lot cozier once it's done. Then the next video I will make is probably in half a year or so when it's like completely finished. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's definitely getting there. So yeah, this is the this is the sound bar that comes with TV If you don't really understand how this TV can be this thin look at this. Oh my goodness Oh my goodness just for a little reference guys. It's thinner than my iPhone. It's legit thinner than my iPhone You see that? Oh my goodness. So you're, you're probably wondering how does this 4k OLED TV get this thin? Well, every that has to do with the TV, like, you know, all the connections are in this sound bar. The panel just connects with one really cool, nice cable to this thing. And uh, so yeah, that's where you plug in your HDMI cables and everything. Which by the way, these little speakers over here, they come up like we're in the future. Wait, let me just show you, where's the remote? All right, this is an awesome remote. All right, I'm gonna turn it off, listen to this. Now I'm gonna turn it on, watch. Watch these little speakers, okay, watch them. Here we go. <gasps> Woo oh my goodness. And just so you know, this is the most beautiful TV I've ever owned. It's amazing, and also look. By the way, the picture quality on this thing is amazing because it's OLED. If you don't know what OLED does, it's pretty much that the blacks are actually black. You know, if you, if you watch TV on a normal TV, you know, one of those normal ones, and there's a shot where, uh, you know, there's, it's quite dark there or whatever, there's black bars on a movie. Those black bars aren't actually black on a normal TV. Now on this one, it's as black as you can get. Now, as you can see right now, I'm playing some kind of OLED gallery. It's just a couple of pictures on the TV, but it legit looks like it's a painting. It looks real. It's weird. And that's because the OLED makes the greens greener, the reds redder, and the blacks blacker. It makes it look real. It's weird, but super cool. Now the image is amazing, but something that's also pretty cool is that the sound bar over there actually has Dolby Atmos Theater surround sound. So the sound out of that thing is actually freaking amazing. So that's that also comes with the TV. <laughs> this TV is insane. I mean, look at that. Doesn't it just look like it's just a painting? Oh, the painting just changed. It's hard to capture this on video, how insane the quality is. 
Is this real life, guys? Is this real life? Try to find a pixel. Is this real life? No. It's a TV. <laughs> There's actually a uh, setting on this thing. Let me have a look where it is. That that it pretends to be a window. Let me have a look. Um, OLED gallery. This one, this one. The rainy day. It also comes with some amazing sound. Let me just turn that on. So now it's pretending to be a window, like I'm looking outside a window. <laughs> and it's hard to capture this on video, but it looks real. It's, it's so real, I just want to touch it. <laughs> See, as you can see, there's like some 3D perspective things going on. It just really messes with your head. <laughs> oh, darn it, my window is dirty. There's rain on it. I need to clean it. Oh, wait, it's the TV. Oh. Nala, do you enjoy looking out the window? <laughs> Look, she's looking at the window. She's like, any doggies out there? Any doggies, any birds that I can catch out there? <laughs> The official name for this TV is the LG Signature OLED TV W. And the W stands for wallpaper because it's as thin as wallpaper. <laughs> so yeah, massive shout out to LG for hooking me up with this amazing looking television. I will leave all the information in the description if you want to get one yourself. It's mad bro. It's really mad. So yeah, that pretty much covers the living area where we watch TV. Like I said, it's not finished yet. We need curtains all around, and we need nice carpets to make it cozy, because currently it's not really cozy yet. All right, I forgot to say, these are my play buttons. Uh, we have a one million play button, 100K, and 100K as well, with a plan. Yeah, we still need to hang them up. I don't really have a spot for them yet, uh, but we'll figure it out. Yeah, we need to hang up a lot of things. There's like a really beautiful painting there, a jelly painting. There's like an elephant here. And behind this elephant, there's a skyline mirror. I mean, oh, there's so many things we need to hang up, but it's just a lot of work. Also, this is where we dry our laundry because we don't have a dryer yet. It's still on its way. Everything's taking so much time. So yeah, let's move on to the right side of the hallway. The hallway is right here. So like I said, there's a left side and a right side. So let's go that way because this is only half of the house. Hello dog. Oh my God. <laughs> Nala, what did I say? What did I say? She's pretending like she didn't do anything. All right, let me clean this up. All right, there you go. Cl cleaned up. Yeah, I hope you understand now what I have to live with. So this is the right side where we have a bedroom, an office, an office, a bathroom, and another bathroom. Let me show you around the first office. I don't really have any storage compartments yet, so we still have like a box full of wires with like an Oculus headset and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, this is my office room, just so you know. As you can see, there's a window here as well. I can walk onto the terrace from my office. Um, so let me show you. The keyboard is amazing. The mouse is amazing. We've got two monitors, 27 inch. Uh, they're 144 hertz, they're not 4K monitors. We've got a really sweet broadcaster. We've got a custom PC over here. Oh, this thing is such a beast. Look at that. Oh, look at all those sexy lights. Oh, look at those lights. Oh, there's legit lights everywhere, but I still need to configure them. It's quite a mess. We've got a PlayStation 4, a MacBook, some more lights, some Oculus things, a tennis ball because dogs. Uh, a lot of foam and lights. Now I'm going to replace these lights soon with LEDs because these generate quite a lot of heat, but um, the foam actually works really well. We still need to put foam on this wall um, because we ran out. Yeah. <laughs> There's some more foam here that <clears throat> Nala has eaten on. I love this dog. She's great. So yeah, that's my office room. Um, it's not the most pretty office room I've ever owned, but eventually guys, once I've got more time, we're going to make this thing look really, really nice. So, so is the entire house. Like, we're, we still need to do a lot of things, but, you know, this, I can live with this for now, but, you know, I want, like, cool LED lights and cool stuff everywhere. We're gonna get there. I promise. Anyways, that's my office room. Let's move on. Dog. All right, so that's my office. Then we've got a second office over here. Technically, they're bedrooms, by the way. We just turned them into offices because we need offices. This is Santa's office. If you want to see a detailed tour of it, go to her channel. This is where she keeps Nala. And this is Tana. <laughs> it's really creepy. And she has a beautiful window as well with a really, really, really nice view. Oh, my God! <laughs> and yeah, there's dogs and 
stuff. So yeah, she loves plants. I don't know if you've noticed, there's plants around the entire house. <laughs> she loves plants. Uh, it's pretty much the exact same setup. Exactly I'm actually trying camera. to listen to what I'm actually saying here because uh, I'm, edit I'm editing a video. Can you please go? Okay. okay. Love you. Okay. All right, so that's Hannah's office. Then on the right over here, we've got a bathroom, which is technically a guest bathroom, but because we lack some storage space, this is currently full of storage. So there's a little sink here. There's a little bathroom shower around that corner over there. I don't know if you can see it, like over there. Nala, we're not, we're not going in here. Nala, come in. Come on, come on, Nala, good girl. So yeah, that's the guest bathroom to these technically bedrooms, but we turned them into offices, you know. Then we have the monster bedroom where the magic happens. Okay, no magic happens here. Anyway, plant, more plants, a, a nice little mirror. And this is the only room where we actually have curtains because we sleep here. Now, you cannot sleep without curtains, uh, but we still have to cut them. These We just legit bought these from Ikea and just hung them up because we need to sleep here. Again, we have some more to view that we can see throughout the entire house. This dog is crazy. This is a dog shoe, by the way. You like dog shoes, Nala? Nala, you like dog shoes? This is the bed, Nala sleeps here, and then we've got an ensuite and a closet. An ensuite and, a more, and another plan. Um, this bathroom has a bathtub, a toilet, some storage things. Actually, we're lacking storage things in the house, like really bad, because as you can see, there's no storage thing beneath the sink for some reason. So we're gonna get one custom build, but for now, we just need to leave everything on the sink. So yeah, then we have a shower over here. All right, so that's pretty much it for the house, guys. But you haven't seen outside yet. I mean, you've seen inside, but one third of the house is actually outside because we've got a massive terrace. Look at that. Now we've got plants that are dying because it's winter. <laughs> so yeah, like I said, this terrace is quite massive. If I'm correct, it's 85 square meters. I'm not sure if you know anything about that, but there's a random creepy chair there. <laughs> this terrace is gonna be really nice once it's finished. We're gonna put a different floor here. There's gonna be jacuzzi on here. There's gonna be like a barbecue. There's gonna be a launch area over here. There's gonna be an eating section over here. And yeah, oh, we're, we're at the kitchen again, by the way. So you see, we can walk around the entire house just like that. So that's pretty much it for the terrace. I mean, it's really nice to just be able to get some fresh air and walk around. And there's a little corner here as well, like you, as you can see. We don't have any terrace furniture yet. It's winter time, so we couldn't be bothered buying it because first of all, it's expensive. Second of all, we couldn't use it because it's winter. Third of all, we're not gonna be here for the winter, so yeah. So this is the view. Let me show you some more clips of the view here. And uh, it's, it's quite nice, I mean, Right now the weather isn't the greatest, but when the sun is shining, it's quite busy out here on the waters. There's a lot of boats, there's cows here. The cows swim in these waters actually, it's kind of weird. There's a lot of fishermen here sitting here fishing all the time. So yeah, there's that. It's a really nice place to live. And yeah guys, that's pretty much it for the house tour. Unfortunately, all the doors are closed, so I need to go all the way to the end to actually get into the house. Um, Nala, are you coming with me? Nala, come. Come Nala. Come on. There you go, that's my dog. That's my dog. All right, come on, Nala. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, it's not the craziest house you've ever seen on YouTube, but it's, it's a decent house, you know? It's nice to live in. It's a nice place. We live in a very good and nice neighborhood. Uh, so yeah, I'm happy. Hope you liked it. I'll catch you next time when the house is finished. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, click on that subscribe button. And also, make sure to check out the new exclusive Jelly Army t-shirts on jellystore.com.